Oh, look, a bunch of corpses. Clearly a place I've been. Alright, well, that is the place we continue to go to. I don't really know if I want to... Actually, let's check out some of these. Nope. I would guess that things like communication and security would be in there. Although, we can just check around to see if there's any ventilation shafts. That will let me go in there. I'll just go through. There's nobody. There's nobody left alive to even care that I'm. I walked. Just, I just walked through a thing. Hey, what's here? I think I've already been here. Uh, yeah. There's like a level two computer. I couldn't do anything with that. Well, let's see if I got a username and password yet. Nope. Okay. Uh, code for this? Nope. This is special operations. Sadly, cannot get into that room. Alright. I know, I know, yeah, I know someone's gonna kind of say, why don't you just invest one point in attacking? I, I, I feel like playing it for a change. In a way where I don't need to do that. Uh, you know, I'm just gonna play, oh god. Alright. Oh, it, it activates with security. I didn't realize that. Alright, let's go through this. It's different. It really is. To play like this. It's kind of fun. It really... It like... You make certain things easier and certain things harder. And what are we doing? Subject. Recognized. Access granted. Why, thank you. It would still be really quite nice if I got a silencer on this weapon. Is that... Is that the... Uh, is that her from the thing? Oh, combat rifle. Okay. That's kind of nice. I got a combat rifle now. Let me just switch this up and just start putting this stuff over here. I'll keep the combat rifle. Oh no, that's a shotgun. Sorry. I like a combat rifle. Damn it! I would have. I would have friggin' kept that thing too. Okay, I can't. I can't really do much about those guys right now. Or maybe I can. Maybe this event that goes back to them or something. Yeah. Well, there's ammo capacity, so ah, whatever. I'll just keep it on me for now. Let's just keep going. So they can't see me. I take it. Okay. Now you want to talk to me? So you can legit see me. Oh, they're asking who I am. I'm no one. <laughs> Goodbye. Wait, who's gonna hit the alarm? I love combat rifles. Thank you. And thank you. It's like the easiest way of dealing with everything. It's it's like literally this is the lazy way of playing this game. Ah. Oh. Right. Oh, that dealt with him. Oh, there's robots up there now. And I lack EMP grenades. Uh, having rockets would have been useful. Ah. <sighs> Damn it. Well. Oh, I can punch through the wall. And it's just for beer. If I had the, the jumping og, I could make it up there, but I can't. This is if you're doing the other kinds of stealth run. Which I'm not. Uh, I'm good with drinking some beer. How much else do I have? Can't really see. I'm gonna assume not enough. 
whatever. Hi, hi, how are you doing? They really don't like me having my gun out. You know, I just killed some guys. You don't get to tell me what to do. I've been drinking again. Uh. Taking this with me. Oh wow, okay, I was just saving it there and uh, I almost set it off. Nice, more combat rifle. Alright, let's see, hopefully one of their damn pocket secretaries, okay there we go. Blind eye. Oh no, that's like, what the hell? Uh, e, F, E, Leist. Whoops. Okay, good. It worked. Uh, this, this is a great, uh, security system. I just want to mention that right now. I can't... I thought having the login would allow me to disable stuff. Oh. Uh, but I have the, I have the login for this. Alright, um... Something about Burke. Some other stuff. Okay, I got nothing of any usefulness here. My real disappointment is that I wasn't going to let me... Oh. Keitner, Jensen. I'm in your detention camp and uploading to the security mainframe now. Copy that. Any problems? Nothing I couldn't get rid of. Yeah, well, we'll talk about that later. Right now you need to get inside the interrogation wing and find out what Burke is hiding. Contact me when you know. Keitner out. This game keeps reminding me that I am, uh, I'm shooting the crap out of everything. I'm not entirely sure as to why. They, they talk about it as if it's a bad thing. And they make me feel bad. Okay, I don't need either of these. Ooh, what's in here? Oh, I haven't been here yet. Credit, oh wow, that's a lot of money. Uh, well, nothing really else uh, of any importance here. Oh, this is this is down here. Oh, I see. I guess it's an alternate way, if, in case you wanted to go that way. Whatever, I didn't. It's my own choice and my body, etc. Nothing here. You are dead. Not a big surprise. People need to stop whining. Now nah, I'm guessing that there's bots here. Or maybe that there isn't. Where is he? There you are. Let me go get some of those, uh, those crates. I need one. Because I don't really have anything else to deal with him right now. So, preferably I'd like to use the environment and what I have at my disposal to get rid of him. If that means carrying around this thing, that's exactly what it means. Okay, got one. One down, one to go. I'll just get more. There was more of those things. Uh, they are over here on the exact opposite side. And there's no stairway other than the other one, so... Isn't that just grand? How can a bot be alarmed? Robots are the future, man. They suck. Alright. Aha. Uh -huh. Come, come get me. Mostly because I have to go back and go reload. As in, grab another barrel. You know, I was never able to take out that turret, but I can take out these guys at least. That makes me happy. Okay. Go in the other direction. Go. Damn it! 
Fuck. Oh, that's it. You're getting shotgunned. Oh, this is not going to be effective. I take it this is not effective. That was my last and only hope. Uh, what else do I have? Okay, let's start exploring a little bit more. Okay, I can't do anything with you guys. Oh, there was a door I saw earlier. Let's go check out that. Since I'm clearly not able to go up there anymore. This would be where I came from. How do you dicks not have- okay, you have combat rifle ammo and some credits. Uh, you know what, I think that store guy may, may have sold me some EMP grenades, but I didn't take him. <sighs> What's he- what the fuck is he doing? He seems to be just staying online. Fuck it. Floating crate of magic. <laughs> Whatever. Ah, uh, really? One of you things? I guess I'll just trigger it and leave. Oh, another. Ah, uh, I think it's the same wall, actually. I think this is pointless. Yeah, there's no point in me going up here. So you have a bunch of books. And a bunch of crap I don't really care about. You know, maybe this this wasn't the first game. I just, I, I started the Human Revolution. Uh, but I just never realized it because I never used it. That actually could be the case. Because I, I never really did set off alarms. I, I'm kind of a little bit slacking off in this one. This run. Oh, here we go. These are very convenient walls. Nothing I can really see that I actually want. I used to get, like, bleach. You know? I know many jails that wouldn't give you that. I don't know why I would know that, but... What have I alarmed? The robot? Well, we're done here. Alright, let's see what's in door number one. Not a sniper rifle, probably. I'm very disappointed to say. Activating security scan. The game absolutely refuses to give them to me. It also likes to take away control from me a lot, like this. Biometric data oh, this is a loading data. screen. I get it. I haven't seen many loading screens. Ah, uh, it is. Do you see? I uh, I was I was kind of always thinking, what the hell is the point of this room? Recognized. Access granted. Okay, I'm gonna eat two things of pills. Let's switch to those grenades. It all makes sense now. So I guess they were just experimenting. It's probably some new Unreal Engine thing. Okay, so these would be the uh, interrogation chambers, I'm guessing. Yeah, I'll drink beer, and now I'm at 200 health. Which is nice to be at that much health. Alright, let's see what we got. Oh, we got a hypostim here. And that's pretty much the... Oh yeah, this is the... Can you see through that mirror? No, it's, it appears black, but on this side, it's clear. Post-interview log. Patient has been returned to detention area after sedation. Medical history gathered indicates that she's a prime candidate for inclusion. Similarly, all biological indicators fall within required parameters. Recommend preparation for stage one therapy prior to. Gary, have you seen this? Have you seen what's on this smart disk? He's gone mad. Tiffany, slow down. What are you talking about? Where'd you get that? I found it in the last shipment of materials we received. One of the boxes have been tampered with blatantly. Someone was sending this to me, to us, to warn us about Commander Burke. Uh, that sounds a little far-fetched, don't you think? 
I know the two of you have butted heads, but Bob's assured me that the commander is with us on this. Really? So Mr. Page is okay with us using unwilling human test subjects, is he? What's his opinion on Bell Tower using the OCM to further their military aspirations? Ask him about this Hydra project. Tiffany, calm down. I know all about the Hydra project. It's nothing nefarious. It's simply a means of allowing soldiers to communicate more efficiently when in the field. You've seen Burke's augmentation. It has nothing to do with the OCM. So, you think his obsession with this technology is because he's an environmentalist? Gary, I know this bothers you too. Those poor women. We can't keep doing this. We can't just rush blindly ahead and let men like Burke pull our strings. Science has made that mistake before. I know. All right. All right. Let's go down below and contact Bob. We'll see what he has to say about this. I know he's intrigued by the nanotech possibilities. Certainly, he's disappointed with the results we've had. Okay. Interesting story element. Uh. Huh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll stay quiet. I promise. Just don't hurt me anymore. Calm down. I'm not gonna hurt you. You're not one of them? One of the scientists? Please. You've got to get me out of here. You've got to do something before they come back. I don't want to disappear like all the others. It's okay. What's your name? Nina. Nina Sullivan. I, I don't know why they're holding me in here. They just grabbed me off the street. I, I heard Cape Town was dangerous, but I thought, look, with all the security around... Cape Town? South Africa? Isn't that where we are? I, I blacked out. They drugged me, I think. I was on vacation in Cape Town at the end of the summer. I was going to be starting senior year in the fall, and I wanted to have an adventure. My parents must be so worried. I take it you're not a terrorist, then? No. I've never done anything wrong. Never demonstrated against anything or, or anything. But neither have most of the girls here. I'm not sure about the men, but please, can't you get me out of here? I want to help you, but you've got to stay calm. Now, what did you mean by disappear like the others? What's been going on back here? I don't know much. I've heard rumors and seen some things, and I know what they've done to me. Biopsies, blood samples, tissue cores, like I'm some sort of lab rat. Is that why you're back here? Separated from the others? This is where they sit study and examine us see if we're compatible or something. I don't know what they want from us. Sometimes we're sent back to the cells. Those that aren't. Well, some of the others think they let them go, but I think they're being sent somewhere else. Another facility, maybe, or somewhere else besides this one. Why? What makes you think that? Because of the way they talk when they're with us. It's like they're looking for some kind of perfect gene match or something. I. Not a doctor. I don't understand it. I just don't want them touching me anymore. Hold on. You said they were coming back? Who? Burke? Is he behind this? I... I'm not sure. He comes around, but not that often. I know he gives the orders around here, but he doesn't seem all that interested in us beyond some psych tests and questioning. He mostly leaves us to the doctors, or scientists, or whatever they are. Tell me about these scientists. Is one of them a woman named Reed? I don't know. I mean, there is a woman, but her name is Kavanaugh, not Reed. I heard the guard call her that. She's... She seems different. Like, she doesn't like what they're doing to us. I can't help but think she's being forced to do these things. The others just treat us like animals. It's horrible. I just want to go home. I know this is going to seem cruel, but I can't help you right now. You're going to leave me here? You can't. You have no idea what it's like. Please. 
I can't have you tagging along just yet, or walking the halls alerting the guards. Trust me, when I can get you out, I will. But your best bet is to stay put. I'll, I'll alert them anyway. Perk and the two doctors were just here heading for the morgue. I'll tell them you're here. I will. Let me out or I'll tell them, I swear. And then what? Do you really think they'll let you go? I'm still the best chance you've got, but you have to be patient. Goodbye. That's kind of sad, really. Alright, uh, eh, credit shit. Pocket secretary, sure. Oh, and we get a username and password now. I cannot. <laughs> Walking, work harder. And there's a bunch of rubber arms. Clinical trial log 11 slash 27. Attending, Dr. Tiffany Kavanagh. Dr. Gary Savage, observing Commander Peter Burke. The patient has been sedated and restrained. Administering compound P-026, 1.75 cc's. Injection via the left suboccipital triangle, isolating the neocerebellum and pontine nuclei. Well done, doctors. Appears that the spinal cranial replacement was successful. She's been stable for 48 hours. Placing the upper column and posterior skull is more complex than your own hindbrain augmentation commander work, but it's well within our abilities. That's not our sticking point. I'm quite aware of what your sticking point is, Doctor. Getting results that I can use. Gary? Gary, she's waking up. Look at the alpha waves. They're attenuating. Blood pressure and heart rate are rising. O2 saturation is really low. Savage, get this under control. Tiff, increase sedation and disconnect the OCM interface. Get a dose of propofol ready, see if she stabilizes. It's not working, Gary, damn it! There's a rupture in the circle of Willis. Anterior cerebral artery. Shit, shit! I've gotta get in there! It's already too late, Tiffany. You know that. Is it still alive? No. Now we've lost her. I don't understand. She burned out so quickly. Arterial degeneration was clearly more advanced than anticipated, but still, the new compound should have worked. Dispose of the body. I'll have the next viable candidate prepared and sent down to you, Dr. Kavanaugh. Fasting. Aww. It's experimentation. <laughs> they have big chairs. Oh, she's clearly not happy. Jensen, Jensen handled that one pretty well, though. He's like, then what? What are you gonna do? Nobody's gonna save you if you rat on me. Uh, are these trans? Are these the trank tranks I just picked up? I think they are. Yeah, still got the sniper. It's taunting me. Okay. Uh. We'll explore this last room, and then I need a cutting point somewhere. Another data storage device. I wonder if they're collectibles or something. Uh, ooh, computer, which I don't have. Oh, no more tears. <laughs> ah, that's mean. Next shipment. Some candidate transfer and supplies. Okay. Well, I don't have much more except for beer to grab. And a credit shit as well. Okay. Wow, it gave me a lot of money. And I can't really go into here, I think. As much as I'd want to. Alright, I'm going to cut it here and uh, I'll see how I cut it up. So, uh, see you in a bit.